Hi, it's Steve from Part Select. Today we're going to show you how to change the oven temp sensor on your range. And it's a really easy job. All we're going to need is a number two Phillips or a number two square head screwdriver and maybe a pair of wire strippers and crimpers. Let me show you how we do it. Now before we begin this repair, the first thing we'll need to do is to disconnect power to the range. So if it has a cord on it, simply unplug it. And if it's a hardwired range, we will need to locate the breaker or fuse panel and disconnect the power there. Now the first step in this repair will be to open the oven door and remove the upper rack if it's in the way. And then we're going to remove two screws that hold that sensor to the back wall in the upper left hand corner. Now next we will need to access the back of the range to disconnect the wire harness to that sensor. So you may have to pull the range out from the cabinets enough to get in behind it. Now this model has three screws that secure the center portion of the back panel. We just need to remove those. Next we're just going to tilt it up slightly at the top and then lift straight up on it until we line up the two tabs on the side and then we can lift that panel away. Now next, to gain access to that oven sensor, we'll remove this little side panel. And then we can locate the harness. So we'll disengage the locking tab. Now to disconnect that sensor harness, we'll just depress that locking tab that is on the sensor end, push it firmly in, and then disconnect the harness. Then you can rotate it out through the retaining tab and then we'll push the sensor out through the oven. So we'll just feed that harness through the opening in the back while we pull the sensor through from the front. Now we'll carefully compare the old and new sensor to make sure that they have the same type of connector. If they don't, you will need to pull back the insulation on the new sensor, strip the wire back, cut the old harness off on the oven side, and then moret them together with the porcelain style high temp morets. The original, so we're going to next feed that sensor through from the front. And we'll pull that harness completely through. There's a slot in the opening in that insulation that will feed it through. And then we'll carefully put that insulation back in position. And we can reconnect to the main harness. Make sure that the locking tab engages. Now we can replace that side access panel. Hook the two tabs in the top. Line up the slotted opening on the bottom. And replace the screw. Next, we'll replace the center portion of the back panel. Just lift it up into position, line up the two tabs on the side, and then just push down on it, making sure that both sides engage. And then also the two tabs on the bottom, make sure they engage that panel. And then replace the three screws. And now we're ready to push the range back into position and then we'll 
reattach the two screws in the front of the sensor to the back of the oven wall. Now we'll replace the two screws. And now we're ready to reconnect the power. And our repair is complete. I told you it was an easy job. Thanks for watching, and good luck with your repair.